a famous man once said, preach the gospel, die and be forgotten. The irony of this is that the man is famous for saying that, but to have that humility, to have that reverence of God is astonishing. To count yourself as nothing, that he be counted everything. It is the goal, nay, it is the standard we should all strive for. Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, the greatest, the most powerful man of his day, he understood this. Now don't get me wrong, he didn't always see things that way. The Bible tells us that when he looked over all his kingdom, all that he had built, he looked upon himself with arrogance and pride. But what did God do? God made this mighty king think he was an ox for seven years. Imagine the most powerful man in the world on his knees eating grass. Why? Because it is God who is to be glorified, not us. We are to be nothing. He is to be everything. So when Nebuchadnezzar awoke from his madness, he looked up to heaven and said, all the inhabitants of the earth are accounted as nothing. None can stay his hand or say to him, what have you done? This is the kind of attitude we should all long for. How could we forget John the Baptist? When everybody was leaving him and going to Jesus, did he say, people should be coming to me, not him? No. He said, I must decrease, he must increase. Is he not saying the same thing as Nebuchadnezzar? I am nothing, he is everything. This is the mindset we should live with. This is the truth our heart should hold. This should be our every stride and inclination to the core of our being. So when this guy said, preach the gospel, die and be forgotten, he meant it. He didn't want his name put beside that quote. His focus was Christ. And we live in a day and age where everybody wants you to look at them. Look at me for what I can do. Praise me for who I am. I am strong, I am brave, I am free. But this egotism serves no one but themselves. But we, we are called to be humble, to reach people with the word of God, to give them the only message that holds true hope, to bring people alongside of us, to glorify God, because when it comes down to it, it's not about you, and it's not about me. It's not about any of us. It's about him. May we preach the gospel, die, and be forgotten. May we all decrease that he may increase. May we all be counted as nothing, that he be counted everything.